What's going on, everyone? Welcome back. It finally feels like the time is now for Saitama to start to make some moves we're going to talk about in this video. But make sure you are subscribed to the channel. Give this video a thumbs up. So let's take a look at Saitama 2653 right now up 14.2%, which is good. We haven't talked about that for quite some time. Looking at the daily volume stats, 5.5 million, good number, $1.4 billion in market cap. So some pretty strong news. We have seen some very nice buys, 75 ETH, 57 ETH. A lot of money swapping, you know, this 60th swapping into Shiba Inu. I'm going to talk about that in just a minute. But for the first time in a long time, we are seeing Saitama start to make some moves. So let's take a look on why I think this is starting to move. Well, first and foremost, let's take a look at Ether Scamming C. 328,331. That number is rapidly climbing, which we haven't seen for a while. And when we take a look at some of these transactions, we can see Poloniex, Get.io, are all starting to load up on their liquidity again go on to page two these are all recent transactions hot bits starting to load up go on to the next page and again you can see that uniswap are starting to come through so there's a lot of big exchanges starting to load up on their liquidity what does that tell me it tells me they know something it tells me something is happening it tells me there's a belief right now that saitama is going to start to move why else are they loading up and they're loading up on pretty big bags of saitama as well so um you know 130 trillion tokens some big volume and they are moving in quite big um buys so exciting to see definitely going to start to see some of that moves we also saw this now some of you might be thinking well what are you talking about mike that makes no sense whatsoever but for me this does this talks about a real business strategy mrs saitama guru has deleted or stopped posting on her twitter account and now we know there was a lot of fud a lot of noise and a lot of just distractions i think with the saitama token so interestingly that that has been closed and it's probably the best thing for her because she can go and concentrate on what she was doing and i do think it's a good thing for the token it allows the team to really focus on what they want to do we also are seeing more and more of david guckstein getting involved with saitama is there a partnership coming i think a lot of people believe there is everise a very very popular up and coming crypto right now but david guckstein is talking a lot with saitama we know that he did the spaces with russ and I think a lot of people are starting to get involved. You can see Jake Gagan here, you know, talking to, about him. There's definitely a desire. There is something brewing, I think, in the background with Saitama and Everize, which I think could be a huge partnership. I think David Gorstein, very influential individual in the space, has a lot of knowledge. And I definitely think something is in the background starting to work through with Everize. Let me know in the comments down below what you think. And then I saw this tweet from Zach Herm, which I thought was a really interesting tweet. And it says, why I would not sell Saitama right now? Take a lesson from SHIB. It trended sideways for four months after its first ATH, the bottom charts. This is the SHIB chart here. Look exactly what Saito is doing currently on the top chart. ShibaSwap launch was bumpy. There was lots of FUD in the community as well. And I think that just goes with any meme token that is trying to separate itself from just a kind of dogecoin in its original point where it was just a, a token of value into a real use case and we know that there's a huge plan for saitama but i do think it's interesting faltron dropping the bomb saying this is it but look for me it's a really interesting chart and i do think at the start of any token it is always bumpy and it is always kind of a little bit up and down in terms of getting it people get in make a lot of money get out people fomo in and then just want to take their money back out through nervousness so i do think we are in the early stages of saitama and i think these two charts are very very interesting now we know right now that shiba inu is going absolutely insane up 50 percent on the seven day and i think saitama is starting to follow suit i think people are moving from other tokens that maybe aren't doing so well into things like shibnobi uh, into sorry into saitama and shiba inu also are eagerly anticipating the launch of lily finance now we know that it was delayed while Sata mask was completed and while everything was up and running but i do think we are getting ever nearer to lily finance launch and we saw it originally Sata started to pump before the lily launch people were getting in ready to start the swap function and i do think we are getting towards that point again where we're going to see it over the next kind of 48 hours maybe not from today but certainly we're going to start to see it when you take a look at the gas fees right now ethereum gas fees have been pretty cheap over the last couple of days as well so 62 dollars right now if you were to do an average transaction which is good so i think people are taking an opportunity they're getting their bags ready and they are starting to load up on saitama ready for that lily finance swap that's my view on this but let me know in the comments down below what you think and I'll see you guys in the next one.